Nehemiah chapter 11 Now the leaders of the people dwelt at Jerusalem. The rest of the people cast lots to bring one out of ten to dwell in Jerusalem, the holy city, and nine-tenths were to dwell in other cities. And the people blessed all the men who willingly offered themselves to dwell at Jerusalem. These are the heads of the province who dwelt in Jerusalem. But in the cities of Judah everyone dwelt in his own possession in their cities, Israelites, priests, Levites, Nethanim, and descendants of Solomon's servants. Also in Jerusalem dwelt some of the children of Judah and of the children of Benjamin. The children of Judah, Athaiah, the son of Isaiah, the son of Zechariah, the son of Amariah, the son of Shephatiah, the son of Mahalalel, of the children of Perez. And Maaseah, the son of Baruch, the son of Kalhoza, the son of Haziah, the son of Adiah, the son of Joyarib, son of Zechariah, the son of Shaloni. All the sons of Perez who dwelt at Jerusalem were 468 valiant men. And these are the sons of Benjamin, Salu, the son of Mishalem, the son of Joed, the son of Padiah, the son of Koliah, the son of Maaseah, the son of Ithiel, the son of Jeshiah, and after him Gabai and Salai, 928. Joel, the son of Zikri, was their overseer, and Judah, the son of Senua, was second over the city. Of the priests, Jediah, the son of Joarib, and Jachin, Sariah, the son of Hilkiah, the son of Mishalem, the son of Zadok, the son of Moriah, the son of Ahitub, was the leader of the house of God. Their brethren who did the work of the house were 822, and Adiah, the son of Jeroham, the son of Peleliah, the son of Amzai, the son of Zechariah, the son of Pasher, the son of Malchijah, and his brethren, heads of the father's houses, were 242. And Amishai, the son of Azarel, the son of Azai, the son of Meshilamoth, the son of Immer, and their brethren, mighty men of valor, were 128. Their overseer was Zabdiel, the son of one of the great men. Also of the Levites, Shemaiah, the son of Hashab, the son of Azrakam, the son of Hashabiah, the son of Bani, Shabbathai, and Jozebad, of the heads of the Levites, had the oversight of the business outside of the house of God. Mataniah, the son of Micah, the son of Zabdi, the son of Asaph, the leader who began the thanksgiving with prayer, Bakbukiah, the second among his brethren, and Abda, the son of Shemua, the son of Galal, the son of Juduthan. All the Levites in the holy city were 284. Moreover, the gatekeepers, Akkub, Talmon, and their brethren who kept the gates were 172. And the rest of Israel, of the priests and Levites, were in all the cities of Judah, everyone in his inheritance. But the Nethanim dwelt in Ophel, and Ziha and Gishpah were over the Nethanim. Also the overseer of the Levites at Jerusalem was Uzai, the son of Bani, the son of Hashabiah, the son of Mataniah, the son of Micah, of the sons of Asaph, the singers in charge of the service of the house of God. For it was the king's command concerning them that a certain portion should be for the singers, a quota day by day. Pethahiah, the son of Meshezabel, of the children of Zerah, the son of Judah, was the king's deputy in all matters concerning the people. And as for the villages with their fields, some of the children of Judah dwelt in Kirjath Arba and its villages, Dibon and its villages, Jacabziel and its villages, in Jeshua, Moleda, Beth Pilet, Hazer Shul and Beersheba and its villages, in Ziklag and Mekona and its villages, in Enrimmon, Zorah, Jarmuth, Zenoah, Adullam, and their villages, in Lachish and its fields, in Azekah and its villages, they dwelt from Beersheba to the valley of Hinnom. Also the children of Benjamin from Geba dwelt in Michmash, Aijah, and Bethel, and their villages, in Anathoth, Nob, Ananiah, in Hazor, Ramah, Gitaim, in Hadid, Zeboim, Nebalat, in Lod, Ono, and the valley of craftsmen. Some of the Judean divisions of Levites were in Benjamin.